Okay, so it's been a while since I made another video. I've uh, been very busy with some stuff. Uh, I haven't really done anything since the last time with the uh, mug uh, things because I just didn't have any time for it. Uh, I have some orders coming in on the uh, uh, t-shirts, hoodies and uh, a few caps as well, hats. So I've been very busy and so I think I have made, last week I think I made 10 t-shirts and 4 hoodies actually. And uh, a few hats. Uh, just today I got an order on one t-shirt and today I got an order on three t-shirts. So you see there I'm kind of busy with other stuff. But uh, don't worry, uh, as soon as I get some uh, time available, we'll try to dig into the mug sublimation. But for now, uh, no, it's, it's, uh, I don't have time for it. So today I'm doing uh, this, I'm doing three, well I actually uh, have been, been doing five t-shirts today, but uh, due to copyright issues, I can't show them on, on cam, but uh, uh, I'm doing three t-shirts right now uh, That I actually can show on cam here. I, I just uh, uh, used my silhouette cameo to plot the uh, to cut out the design and uh, this is um, um, Looking like this this is actually a Finnish language, and this is Uki. Uki. Uh, it means uh, kind of like uh, grandfather. Yeah. So that's Uki. And uh, the other t shirt um, is actually also Finnish right there. Mummy. Mummy. That's uh, grandmother. Yeah. So that's kind of cool. Uki. And Mummy. <laughs> yeah, and uh, the third t-shirt is actually uh, some quotes from a movie uh, that is looking like this. Star Wars, yeah, Star Wars. So I did a design on this one. Uh, it, I, I came up with this design. I thought it was cool. Uh, so I elaborated a little bit with the different size on, on the letters there. And I came up with this and this will look very cool on a t-shirt I believe. So I'm um, just about to, to preheat uh, the first t-shirt here to get all the moisture out of there. And uh, I will actually put on the design on there yeah so I'm putting the t-shirt right here so I can uh, put the design on there and uh, this is the sign right here mummy mummy so I think I'm I'm pretty sure pretty much where I would like to have this print on here somewhere around there but um, I always measure so that it will be pretty much exactly where I want it to be. So I can see right away that that's not exactly what I want. I'm trying to get it as good as possible. 24, 24, that's pretty much. I go for the seam uh, right here and that's pretty much 13 that's pretty much 13 so this is this is pretty good right here uh, this is pretty good right there uh, so I also make a little measurement like this 47 right here we got 47 so that's exactly uh, the t-shirt can be a little bit uh, you know uh, 
not straighten all edges but that's okay as long as you measure from all directions uh, it will be pretty much lined up the way that I want so when I got the design on there I just do it like this like this and I put it right on here so when I got the design on here the t-shirt on here and I'm happy where the design is on the t-shirt I'm just uh, lining up a little bit so I can see the final results when I have the edges here to work from so uh, this is pretty good I think some measurements and that's uh, six right there yeah seems to be pretty good seems to be pretty good I am very happy with this so some teflon sheet on there I'm doing a full blast of 15 seconds right here 160 degrees um, and just wait for it to beep and open up of course this is an auto opener so that's cool and this teflon sheet is very hot right now so gotta be wow very careful here this is a hot peel so I want to take it off immediately straighten it out a little bit and I take the teflon sheet once again give it another little blast of five six seven seconds or so just to get the, the vinyl to you know uh, There we go. Ouch. Ouch. That's very hot. So there we have the final result right here. This is looking very awesome I think. This is looking very very good right here. Looking good. Looking good. So I did this one. Mm, that's kind of cool. Looking great. Okay, okay. This is a uh, XL, and even though it's kind of very much vinyl here, it seems to be very good. And so that's cool. I mean, this T-shirt will not last forever, but you know, this is some cool stuff right here. So now it's time for this design right here and this design I really would like to place a little higher because it's kind of a, a, a longer uh, design than you know kind of like just a text right here so kind of like a hand wide down and uh, place the design right there of course I will not do anything until I control measured everything so it's kind of like almost or exactly where it's supposed to be 19 that's 19 right there that's pretty much 19 right there the edge down here is almost straight so I have to 29.5 uh,29.5 and this is interesting to see this measure here almost 14 uh, well that's 5 inches and 5 and 1 quarter that's a lot more so I can see right away that I need to get the design a little bit Even though if you're looking in the center of the neck right here, that doesn't really seem to be always the case that the design is 
because when measuring on the sides here you can clearly see that something that is not really right. So what I do then is take somewhere in the middle of everything so uh, I get it as, as good as I can because if you can't get it exactly you gotta improvise. And that's what I think I need to do in this case right here. 14.5 that's 14 and that should be pretty much 14 yeah that's I think that's correct and now down here down here I got 17 right there and right here I got also pretty much 17 not exactly so I just pull it over a little little bit tiny little bit there so I can see that it's perfectly straight 17 17 yeah I think that's about it so I think I'm pretty much happy with this design right here uh, just go ahead and Put it on the heat press right here. Even though I have lined it up already, I always do a double check. So I check the, the edges right here to see that it's lined up with the, the corners here on my heat press. So this seems to be kind of cool. A double check. That's actually 11.5. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Ten. That's pretty much ten as well. Sometimes you gotta improvise and sometimes you can't get everything 100% perfect depending on the garment and you know how it's... The garment itself is not always 100% so... This is not a very easy task but I'm, I'm happy with this and I think it will be awesome. Uh, so I just put on the Teflon there. Wait a little bit. I got it double check something here I see a little problem here maybe that's why my measure wasn't really good so let's double check that just for a moment here 10 10 10.5 Ah, that's terrific. It's 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 perfect now. 11 10.5 ah, I'm happy with that. That is good. It is good. Let's do this. Take it on full blast off, 15 seconds. What the hell? Full uh, 15, 15 uh, seconds and uh, 160 degrees. Sometimes it appears that the pressure is a little bit too high. So I need to loosen this one a little bit. Ouch, that's hot. Peel it off, just like that. Put this on here for another blast of 6-7 seconds or so. I'm losing that one a little bit and bam it's much more easy. So that's cool. Come on. Ouch. That's not good. Whoa. 
There we go. That's perfect. Looking cool. Looking cool. Looking very, very good. I think it's lined up and straight and everything is cool. This is awesome. So that's pretty much uh, what I've done so far. Um, so today I did actually five, six, five, six, uh, eight t-shirts today. And uh, so that's cool. Uh, it's fun when the business starts to going. I mean, this is, I don't really get very, very super much orders, but at least something is something to start with and that makes me happy. So that's kind of cool. Um, also, I have ordered some more hoodies because I have some more hoodies to to put some text on. Um, so that's coming in maybe tomorrow if I'm lucky. Uh, so that's cool. Um, so what I will do right now is actually I will do some packing here. Uh, I'm using Ziploc bags and I'm using these gray little bags right here. These gray bags right here with some glue on there. You just take off the some sheet of plastic there and just put put it together. So that's what I'm using to send it in the in the mail. And I also got, um, I have been spending a lot of time on, on uh, my, my store online. So I got a store online now. I have built it myself and uh, I've been putting on some designs on there and everything. So you should go, and sh uh, well you can't check it out just yet, but I will send you the link in the next couple of days here I believe or so. I'm running out of use of in my battery now so I gotta go. But uh, I'll be back with a new video soon. So take care now. Bye bye then.